Welcome back to WEDF DCO part 3. And oh, okay, a nice counter by Zoltar. By the way, I forgot to mention this. This is a uh, loser leaves town match, so whoever loses, yeah. Leaves, uh, okay. <laughs> loser leaves HCW. And Zoltar is almost out. Oh, but he's got, uh, he gets taken back down by Rick the Fisherman. Rick now. Pondering whether or not he should go up top, but oh, he barely cannot grab the fat of oh, Zoltar. Now Zoltar's on the ground now. Miller's being picked up. Grapple. And thrown right into the cage. And now Rick throwing him again. And again. And again. Trying to make him bleed for what he did to Rick, but oh, he counters. And elbows him in the face. And Zoltar's going to the top now. Oh, but he gets lariated at the top. I didn't even know that was possible. And oh, what the hell was that? Oh shit! Rick is very acrobatic, to say the least. Damn, that was a nice impressive uh, backflip into a famous. Oh, oh, impressive technical ability right there as he nails the arm. Rick went, oh, and a nice impressive leg drop. It's like a bizarre flip to a leg drop. That's an amazing, oh, nice uppercut. Rick now, dominating, dominating Zoltar, and Zoltar, oh! Whatever the hell that was. One, two, no, not yet. Rick being very impressive in the match. Irish from the corner, go into the ropes. Missed by Zoltar. Rick, got a signature. Oh! Reverse pin! One, two! No, not yet. Rick needs to work more on the body. Oh, shit! Oh! And the double arm neck breaker! Could this be it? Oh, this could be it! The fish! Uh, the fisherman suplex! One, two, Three! Rick the Fisherman wins and Zoltar gets kicked out of the DCO. Get the fuck out, Zoltar. We don't even like you anymore. He never even liked you. What the hell? That guy was so fat. He was just like... You know, he was like hitting like a fat off. The last like Smackdown or something? Jesus, that was amazing. They all ate like nachos and shit? Jesus. Anyways, Rick wins. And... Well, Zoltar gets kicked out of DCO. And Rick gets revenge. And shit happens. Ah, oh, this is a great match between these two. Rick's bleeding. Viewer discretion is advised. For fags. No, we're just joking. Rawr. That commercial was for RAR, the up and coming uh, wrestling organization. Yes. Yeah. All right, here we go. Here is uh, Animal Ochi Jacks. And um, we got a lot of tattoos on. Well, and not much is known about Ocean Jacks. All we know is that he's Dave Morrison. Wait, no, wait. I think I get confused, so. But this is a shaman Ocean Jacks. A very unique form of Ocean Jacks, only from the wilderness, you know? With all the, uh, Pikachus. And the other Pokemon. I don't know, I'm like, you live there? Yeah, fuck. Whoa. 
I am awesome. What the fuck is wrong with me? Anyways, OG Dex is coming out here to face someone. I wasn't giving note. I wasn't giving note. So I'm gonna go on my uh, gut feeling that is uh, it's Gregory Black. No, it's uh. Is scheduled for one fall. Approaching the ring. Ah, it's it's him. Ryan Terrain. Otherwise known as Dynamite, a jobber from OCLOL, uh, who lost to a future world champion in uh, SMF, Brian Diaz. Brian Diaz is a very impressive wrestler. He, he, I, I wouldn't know if he's DCO material. He, he, I think he could. He, he's beaten several wrestlers like Ryan Terrain and Ryan Terrain. He's only won one match in his career, but he's he's a, he's a he's a great guy. But uh, otherwise, Ryan Terrain is dynamite from uh, OCL. Well, he was a jobber and never won a match, and I don't think he's gonna win one tonight. He won his first match against fucking uh, Little B, and uh. Little B. Yeah. He's a bitch. What do I gotta say about him? Oh, and a press of right hand to the sternum. But oh! Ryan Terrain getting the upper hand now. Ryan Terrain is slapping. Oh, but no. Ojek ain't having none of that. And oh, right back in the attack. Damn. No remorse from Ojek. And Ojek's now nailing him with that punch. And another one. Ryan Terrain does not know what's coming. Like I said, he, he he only won his first match against Dynamite, so this guy he, he he he's kind of new to the ring. He he semi retired back in 2009. He came out of retirement for DCO, and he hopes to uh, achieve greatness, uh, oh, great success in uh, WEF. And a nice lariat right there, as Ochi Dex is going off the uh, going off on a nice roll. Right there, there's a one. Oh, not yet. But Oshu Jax has been getting getting a mean streak of sorts uh, lately. Destroying people and killing, kicking ass. Oh, but Ryan Terrain! Impressive technical ability by Ryan Terrain. Countering that kick, but oh. Irish whoop. No! And a spine buster right there. And then Oshu Jax moving the pin. One, two. Oh, no, not even a two count. But like I was saying, Oshu Jax is having a mean streak in recent weeks. Attacking, I think, beating the shit out of the gold dust. And etc which uh, I don't get why but I guess he wants to prove himself I mean what other way you have to prove yourself than destroy a bunch of jobbers you know like you're right now destroying a jobber and literally <laughs> Ryan Terrain is one of the biggest jobbers in the business he's dynamite dynamite never won a goddamn match until he just a little B and then he had a little B well he's not really much of competition so I don't know, maybe, maybe I'm like, I'm the only one who sees this, is that Osher Jax, he's, he's an impressive guy, he has, he, like, look at that, just lifting him up with both his hands and just throwing him on the ground, impressive, but he's been destroying jobbers, I mean, it's easy for you to destroy a jobber, I mean, they're not really great wrestlers, well, some of them are, but, these guys are, jo they, they just go out there and lose, so it's not like you're achieving much by beating the guys who have, no, 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 anything really, like Ryan Terrain here, who's just running around and missing, and then a nice neck breaker right there, Ryan Terrain went to the top rope, I don't think he's familiar with the top rope, and just gets kicked off, like I said, Ryan Terrain is not a very, 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 very excellent wrestler, and hell, he's not even mediocre at best. So, beating him, it wouldn't be a surprise to me, because Ryan Terrain, I've seen his matches. I've seen his matches with several OCL wrestlers, such as Danny Jack, but Danny Jack being an OCL wrestler also knows how Ryan Terrain is. I don't think he's really worried about Ryan Terrain and his chat and any at all. Just, I, I wouldn't be worried about Ryan Terrain. And an impressive, <laughs> impressive move by Osher Jax. Osher Jax now sizing him up right there. And, and like I said, Oshijex has even defeated Dynamite back in the OCL, OCL days. And an impressive move by Oshijex again. And there's the pin. <laughs> One, two, no. Oshijex has that impre was impressive in OCL, actually winning the championship. So Oshijex has not, not been in a roll. But I see him getting on a roll 
right like right now he's studying right now because Osha Jax is a really great wrestler like I said he's talented but right now I don't get why he's destroying jobbers you know Bob I don't even know what the hell that was well, like a power driver but uh well yeah she was a power driver but wasn't really a power driver and the F you all right that's great and there's the cover one two three and Osha Jax beats a uh, former OCO uh, member. By the way, I, I mentioned this that OC, uh, Osha Jax and Ryan Terrain both had a match together back in OCO days. So, and Osha Jax beat him. So this is like a rematch for Ryan Terrain. Definitely not prove himself. Like I said, Ryan Terrain is not improved <laughs> after retiring. But that brief retirement didn't help him, but at least he got his first win in DCO. But like Swagger hasn't gotten a win at all. Swagger has not gotten a win. The best victory by Osha Jax. And... What the fuck? Well... I guess Matt, Matt Acorn does have a right to be mad. Yeah, I, I don't know why Suspect got in the match. Is it DGO? Is it DCO? Never mind that, but uh, looks like these guys are on the uh, well, on the same side. Or same thing. Same hat. I don't know. Fuck it. Eh, we got a match next. CJ Wizard. With like 5,000 different themes. And the suspect. CJ Wizard having a lot of momentum in this match because you know what? <laughs> he won his last match! By the Q, but he won his last match because of suspects. Manhood. Anyways, this match will be, I think, five stars. Maybe, maybe more. Because you know what? Winning the. Winning the DCO title automatically might qualify qualify you as a future prospect of DCO. I mean, it's not like you're going to be a submission Swedo and get fired for being unlikable. <laughs> Who likes submission Swedo? I mean, come on, that guy sucked. And here comes the million dollar. Suspect, the rated black superstar. <laughs> Everybody's gonna pay. The guy who still isn't blacker than Javori. The suspect. I wonder if they can come up with Matt, uh, Matt Striker type nicknames of Matt Striker. Matt Striker right now being this man. Being very annoying along the way. Well, this is the uh, DCO title match. And you will be <laughs> well, and this is where the DCO championship. Now we're going to start this match off with these two men being shown the title by Earl Hebner, or whoever the fuck that is. Who is, th you know, I never knew who that guy is. Who is 